the great Cyril Rioli, who we all know has retired this week. And uh, I was fortunate enough to catch up with him on Wednesday. And uh, the first question I asked him at Hawthorne was, how hard has the last 12 months been? I mean, it's not to say that it's been, you know, the hardest 12 months, but I feel like it's, it's you know, it's affected me in, in many ways. And, you know, when my dad sort of went through his stuff, it was, it was pretty heartbreaking to see. And, you know, being away from home and I, um, when, you know, my dad's stuff happened, I, I, I truly probably lost, you know, that fire or that desire to, to compete or to play, and, you know, with, with all these emotions and injury and, and everything, it just... You know, it's probably not the right time, but it is the right time, I guess, to, to go home and, I guess, start start our, our new journey of our lives together, yeah. Hawthorne's known as a family club, and, you know, they don't get that reputation just because it's a nice thing to say. And it seems from an outsider looking in that they've managed your situation with you very well. You know, they've been a huge part of, of you know, of my life, um, you know, taking a, taking a chance on... You know, chubby little kid back in many years ago, but you know they've, they've done a lot for me in, in terms of making, helping me grow as a person and learning things, and you know just sort of becoming an adult. Of um, it, it is difficult, um, you know, that I'm finishing up. You know, when I actually think about it, it scares me. It makes me very nervous, but you know I'll still still watch from afar, still enjoy watching the boys, and, and be a huge supporter of the Hawthorne Football Club. And the coach, you've only had one, really. And I've been pretty fortunate to have that that one coach, obviously, over my whole career. You know, one coach, one club. You know, he's been truly amazing. He's a bit scary. Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, bloody oath. Game reviews is, is something that, you know, I get really nervous of, you know. When he starts to get going, he, he gets a bit of this spit going there. And, um, yeah, it is a bit daunting, but at the end of the day, he's trying to make us better and um, trying to help us, you know, with our footy. So he's, he's, he's there for the right reasons. I mean, there's been some incredible games. Do you, have you had a chance to reflect and do you remember some of those games that we all have got so much joy out of? It's been a bit hard the last couple of years being injured, but, you know, I, I go back to, you know, my first game. Rioli runs through the pack. Oh, absolute genius. So there's his first goal in AFL footy. You know, that was, a, you know, sort of a tick for me of, of the, the, the sacrifices that I made to get to that point and... And then to, I think the next would be, you know, the grand finals and then, the, you know, playing my 100th game. I'm proud of my career, I'm proud of the things that I've done and um, you know, I'm looking forward to the next, next part of my life. For all your fans out there, and we've got not just Hawthorne fans and they're going to miss you. And they've been great supporters of you over the years, haven't they? Yeah, Hawthorne supporters have been everything. Uh, but yeah, there's also been, you know, other supporters from other clubs. But and Delicious gets a good run every <laughs> every now and then around the shop. Um, so I apologise. No, nah, don't. No, nah, that's cool. Um, but you know, things like that. I've, I've always tried to, you know, I guess make time for you know the fans or, or the kids and, and trying to give back to as much as possible because you know I was once that little kid who looked up to, to someone. Finally, you're going to be greatly missed, Cyril, but never forgotten. Mm. No, thank so you. Thank you. Thank you. From I reckon I talk on behalf of all the commentators. Yeah. You've made us all smile. You've given us something to talk about yeah. and um, something to remember that uh, makes us feel a whole lot better. So yeah. thanks, Bruce. Congratulations on a brilliant career. Thank you very much.